Hello everybody, this is Buddy Bison, and I would like to say hello, because I haven't recorded in a while. Uh, I finished the Valkyrie Chronicles at the end of the summer, and have since just been uh, releasing the already edited episodes on a weekly basis. So, now that I am home from college for winter break, I figured, hey, let's play a couple games. This game I've had in my cupboard for a while. Um, so I figured, hey, let's play Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth, because this is a turn-based RPG that I am actually, uh, excited to play. Uh, so, uh, just a couple pre-announcements, uh, while, um, <clears throat> so I've decided that I'm going to try and cut down episode length, uh, to 30 minutes instead of the hour long, that way I can focus on editing, and that way, uh, it won't be so ungodly to sit down, watch them, uh, and edit them. I hope to do better editing on them. And there was one other thing that I wanted to say. Oh yeah, and I got um, I got. <laughs> uh, if you uh, watched any of the videos I uploaded recently, uh, today's date. Can uh, I put a time code on this? Is uh, the day. No, not the day after Christmas. Two days after Christmas, the 27th. Uh, I've already released a messing around in Vegas Pro 14. Or Vegas 14 Pro, whatever it is. Um, so, uh, I'm also going to be able to edit better because shot cut is rather limited. So let's get into the game. Uh, this is turn-based. Uh, sure, let's change options. Ooh, look at all this. Look at all this. Uh, yeah, we can... Yeah, I'll take... Oh, only normal and hard. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, let's just begin with these settings. Um, yeah. So... Oh, happy to. So I don't uh, know all that much about this game. I've seen a, a little bit of it. I know that it is turn-based. It has Digimon from several of the series, not just, like, the first one or two. Um, and... Uh, that's about it. I honestly, one of the main reasons why I chose to play this game is because I recognize the art style. Um, the character design, the, uh, like the art style of the characters and whatnot, not the Digimon, uh, because those already had, uh, stuff, uh, already had, a pre, from the show and whatnot. Uh, those designs, they didn't change those. They just put them in a 3D space. But, um, yeah. So, the character designer is possibly one of the my favorite ones that... <laughs> nerd, nerd right here. Uh, I can recognize uh, some, like, very specific art designers. Or, well, not art designers, artists in their many games. Uh, I don't know this uh, artist's name, but he... Um, yeah, I'm just, I'm not going to read these for you because I believe that you have the intelligence to be able to read. Um, but he, uh, th this artist has a lot of different, uh, facets. Like, he, uh, does some manga, like, uh, Yozakura Quartet, I think. I think that was the name of the manga. He also does art for, uh, light novels and whatnot for, um, um, uh, Is It Wrong to Pick Up Girls in a Dungeon? And then he has also done other video games for the, uh, Shimagami Tensei series, uh, Devil Survivor. Uh, and basically I just really like the art, which, uh, helped me pick up this game because, um, Digimon, uh, I do, I, I honestly do like Digimon, but there were always... It was always just compared to Pokemon, and Pokemon was just always better in a game space. So, there was, uh... Never really any reason for me to get a Digimon game. But then I saw that this was turn-based, that this was by that artist. Uh, it had decent to good reviews, and, uh... Uh, in January of 2018, the sequel to this game is coming out. So I figured, hey, why not, uh, why not play this? And if I like it, I can also just play the sequel. 
So, um, so Digimon, uh, as I says, to me, very similar to Pokemon, but with, of course, very distinct differences that separate it from, uh, that separate it from Pokemon. Like, I like Pokemon because, uh, turn-based, uh, and honestly, it's just really cool. But I feel like Digimon have better designs. Like, I feel like the designs of Digimon, their evolutions, are more in a cool space. Whereas you might get cool Pokemon, you might get cute Pokemon, but generally with Digimon, if they go through evolution, they get cooler. Uh, instead of, like, cuter. And I like that. But what I didn't like was that, uh... Yeah, that, that's my character. Uh, what I didn't like is, uh how Digimon's evolutions weren't permanent. Uh, so, Akino and Blue Box went to Late Night Gab Fest. So, that was just uh, saying, Yo, Digimon, have you ever heard of them? Hacker's like, Yo, you should come here tomorrow or else. Uh, and then, of course, main character is like, Yeah, I'm gonna go. Because, you know, if they didn't, they were... Uh, there wouldn't be a game. So, uh, as far as I know, the uh, one of the main spaces of this game uh, is Eden, which is sort of like a Sora Online Excel World um, area. So I'm going to choose female because I like her design better. <laughs> um, and that that's just it. Uh, name, female... Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll just stick with the base name. Uh, because, you know, well, why not? Make as canon as possible. <laughs> canon video game. So, like... Oh! Look at that. It's like psychedelic -y. But, uh... Yeah. What I didn't like about Digimon is their evolutions aren't permanent, whereas Pokemon they are. Because, um, with, with Digimon being, only having evolution be impermanent, it sort of just felt like, oh, like, look how conveniently we can just power up. Whereas in Digi uh, like Digimon, they're never given like a specific like amount of evolutions. You never know like oh this one's only gonna have three or four. Whereas like Pokemon is like the most you're ever gonna get is three evolutions and maybe a mega evolution. So, um, oh God, I haven't done this in so long that I'm incapable of talking for a long amount of time. But uh, that's also because I'm trying to read this while also talking different words. Um, so, this game is also, uh, I believe, completely in Japanese, uh, just because, well, why dub it? <laughs> Generally, English dubs aren't the best. Uh, although video games, I feel like, have a better tendency to do good. Ooh, okay. So, anxious to eat in this world comes to me. And this is interesting because the main character talks. Uh, I'm here a little earlier than we agreed on. Guessing Akino and Blue Box still aren't here. So I'm guessing, from what I understand, the people in the chat room never actually have met in this virtual space before, which I find odd. Um, they may have, but I'm not completely sure. So uh, this will be the first time I met them outside of the chat room. Okay, yeah. That's, I don't know what their avatars look like, though. But I should be able to figure out. Small dog with the Ian avatars and the area. So, this is interesting because it says avatar, which makes me think that they're customizable. Okay, so I can't I can't spin the camera, but I can zoom in and out. This left control stick. Triangle is menu. Left and right. Oh man, I wonder if I'm gonna get Digimon. <laughs> okay, save. Digiline. Read and reply to receive messages. And I have some yen. A field guide option. Keyword. What the heck? Che check the keywords in your possession. I'm guessing. Uh, I'm not sure what that is. Check player information. Cases under investigation. Hacking skill. Case tutorial. Okay. Uh, sleuth rank. Saved Digimon. Solved cases. Playtime eight. That's okay. Okay. Everything seems to be about what I would expect. Um, 
so I just have to go around checking. Logged in from abroad, so I'll thanks to Ian that can keep up with my buddies. Okay. So, look there, no, don't be obvious. It's a hacker, you shouldn't get too close. Uh, was, uh, I got a cell phone ditch advice for my birthday. Here's my goggles, they're pretty sweet, next time I'll pick you up some. Okay, so, let's start the new cowardly woman. I heard there's an area in Eden filled with hackers. I want the company to shut such a dangerous area down at once. So I'm guessing in this world where you can just go into the, uh, go into the, uh, creepy hacker. I like how it just incriminates him. It's like, he is a hacker. Um, where you can go into it. Hackers would be, like, the worst thing, because I don't, I don't think it would be like, uh, oh, if you die in the, uh, if you die in the, uh, the digital world, you die for real. I think it would be more like, oh, if you were attacked, either the person would be booted based on just, like, coding, being like, oh, if they, if someone goes all aggro on another avatar, um, and some slimy tentacles. It's real fun. as the demon of creepy darkness comes to the pure star, snaps it up, jumping across the room. Running. Okay, so apparently there's a thing that eats avatars. So, uh, so I would imagine, like, oh... Uh, Avatar gets attacked, either y your character gets booted and you just like, you just get logged out, or the person uh, just gets an auto, um, you got a gummy mod medal. For a friend, not here, try community area, so we're just like seeing any time. So, I'm just going around trying to see if there's, I don't know, a proc, the e Avatar's move faster than real people. <laughs> Well, even as an avatar. Okay, so they, so you do feel pain in here, which is interesting. Uh, that's this female student. Uh, my friend's late. I wonder if there's a problem with their access point. Public ones are better, but expensive. So she usually logs in from home. Ooh, we got, we got something in my throat. Uh, where is she? Girl looking for her friend. I'm supposed to meet her. Her name's go, but I don't see her. Anymore. So I'm, I'm honestly interested because you see the main character flying in from. Uh, flying in in the uh, intro sequence, but it makes me wonder if possibly, uh, there you go. wonder if you have to go to a terminal, okay, moving and aided, use the directional to choose, indicate the new, select and log out, okay, okay, so I only have the entrance, I'm just, a round thing with the arrow, okay, I just get, because I had to just talk to one more person. So, there don't seem to be any avatars like them. I guess I showed up too early after all. Yeah, ellipses. Ellipses Carter. Okay, there's still time left before our meeting. We should check out some of the other areas. Ugh, oh, God. So, I guess that's a unique way to make sure you can go around just see some basics. Like, oh, yeah, you talk to people to figure out stuff. Go to the community area. Let's go. Um, just for, like, force a event to happen by talking to so many people. And by so many, I mean a certain number, not uh, way too many. Uh, this is the community area. I like this place. It's quiet and relaxed. Digivice's talk features getting go. Who could it be? I do like how. Uh, at dirt, depending on which like arc of Digimon, which series, the Digivice is either only given to the Digidestined or it's just something that everyone has. Because um, I did watch Digimon for quite a bit. Uh, I watched the first one uh, lightly, and I watched like the extended second one. And this is Mr. Nabbit, the dude that told us just a second behind the schedule. You're going to be late. Hurry up. Look, come to Galacta Park in Kowloon. Okay, Galacta Park. Two friends arrived a little while ago, a little while ago, and are waiting for you. I will get for you all, but everyone has to be there first. Buh bye Buh. Kowloon, isn't that the dangerous area full with hackers? Full with hackers? I feel like that's a translation mishap. Filled with. Oh, should I do? I have to hurry? Okay, calm down. No need to panic. Let's be calm, cool, collected. wonder what you meant by gift. Anyway, let's go to Black Park and kill. So all I have only seen like the first I think hour or so of this game. Never been anywhere near Kellen. How do I get there? Uh, Amy, 
Ami, probably. Uh, might be someone who knows how to get to. Okay, yeah, figured. Probably have to talk to one of the suspicious... Uh, okay, so keywords are just things that I can... Uh, yeah. So during conversation, we'll hear keywords, keywords, who will be marked with a lock icon. It means you can ask a character about that keyword. If you ask about the right keywords, the lock will open, and you'll learn some new information. Okay. I really do wish I could spin the camera, but I guess it's fine. Upamon. Okay. I wonder if, uh, it, I'm guessing those are things that I can use to... I'm, I'm wondering what the metals are. Because I'm, I'm honestly curious. Uh, which in the exact opposite direction. Did you want that metal? Like, I'm wondering how these are going to be used. Because I had imagined that this game would run sort of like uh, Pokemon, where you encounter it and you're just able to, uh, like, weaken it and capture. I'm kind of busy here. Apathetic businessman. He doesn't give a fuck. Prior, you want to go kill him, but why? It's lawless for the hackers. Besides, <laughs> that's what you're into. We're done here. Go talk to a hacker if you want to know about it. It's a hacker looking to me near the entrance. Don't blame me for your foolishness and go up and take responsibility for yourself. I mean, I, I, I don't see why I needed to talk to him to find out that there was a hacker. <laughs> like, why, why was that new information? I saw the dude. Heck, it even, uh, he even said he's a hacker. Go get him. It, it says hacker. Creepy hacker. I want, I want to go to Gotham's Park in Kowloon because we can think you want to test I'll show you the way. This is the URL to their area. Take, he, he is creepy, only because of the way he talks in broken sentences. I got the Earl <laughs> URL. Please don't get angry at me. Uh, I can go to Kowloon. Okay. So that's, we're making progress here. Making plenty good progress. So, uh, I know I said that um, the episodes are going to be shorter than usual. Uh, and I'm just going to put a disclaimer on that one. Um, uh, if I'm doing a new series, like I am with this, and I'm going to also be playing... Uh, no, I'm actually, later today, I'm going to be recording Disgaea PC. Um, those episodes might be a little longer, probably more like the 35-40 mark, because I want to just, I want to make sure I get to something happening. Like whether or not it's, I get my Digimon in half my first battle, I get to the, like the first save point, I, like that type of thing. Um, I want to make sure that something happens. I'm not going to have a full, ooh, I wonder who that man is. Wonder who that Sasuke looking motherfucker is. <laughs> um I always I wanna make sure something happens. Oh, look at her. She is anime angry. So anime angry. Ooh, look at that teddy bear. What the heck is this place? <laughs> Ellipses, exclamation point. It's, it's surprised silence. So I'm late. I'm on me. I go by Aiba. Would you happen to be Akino by any chance? I'm not sure which one of these. I guess I'll just be honest. See, I feel like the audio for the characters speaking is a bit odd, and I'm wondering... I'm wondering if that's either just because my headset is not that good, um, or if it's just the game, because I'm wondering if maybe in the digital, like, world... <laughs> Leave me all alone in such a dangerous place, how do you feel if you were in my shoes? I don't know, I feel pretty damn good. Yes, it's an empty area. Uh, you can easily see whether or not uh, down either hallway. Nokia. 
Are you a phone? You're asking if Blue Box has shown up yet? Oh, he showed up already, right, boys. That even matter. Can you believe this? He's all, oh, I've got to go and find a ghost. And all of a sudden, he's running off by himself. That's how he rolls back. 100% full of himself. Thanks, he. All that? So I'm wondering if it's the audio is just odd in the digital world because, like, it, like in game it's weird, or if it's just the game has just shite audio. Um, goes to the pale boy, heard the rumors, but don't know the details. Or is he playing Duke finds it? I mean, ghosts in cyberspace? That's unscientific. I mean, you're in cyberspace. You're getting to a point where. <laughs> Blue box? Question mark? <laughs> you got some funny screams. <laughs> Gosh, she has a lot of accessories on her wrist. Back on top, I kind of place chicken. The uh, uh, Arata or Blue Box. He has a uh, he has a coat that is reminiscent of uh, the main protagonists from Devil Survivor 2, or at least the 3DS version of it. And I like it. Uh, I'll probably put up a picture or whatnot of it. Uh, never had met here before, have I? Okay, put you in together. So I'm wondering how these people met. Like, it was just a chat. <laughs> Surly, self absorbed, got this weird look in his eye. <laughs> I like it when they make, am I right, oak, oh, <laughs> a one word phrase. Like, am I right? <laughs> like, as though it were one word, not three separate. Uh, I like it. Stupidity for later. Uh, Mr. Navi fellow who called us here might be around. Before a ghost. Doing a little of that. And you found me either. Uh, one name or around a big brown. You think there'd be one or two hackers in the area like Kowloon, no matter how dangerous it is. Okay. Ooh, the miraculous power to change the world. That that's always a good reason to do anything. <laughs> we have all been hacked. <laughs> the program has been installed. Digimon capture. Slow, she broke through my firewall like it was nothing. I do like how they, like that could just, they could use the Japanese word for capture probably, but they used English for no reason. Hang tool that's been making the rounds with hackers lately. You mean like a Digimon, Digimon? Yeah, those ones. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> God, that's so goofy looking. He's, he, it looks like he's making shit bigger with like the finger spread that he does, like right there. <laughs> but, it's so stupid. So you got data now, data monsters captured by scanning. Digimon is short for digital monsters, just like Pokemon is short for pocket monsters. Yeah, you know, Digimon like nasty programs the hacker use, right? Um, means, have we become hackers? Well, you're not a hacker unless you hack something. No, you, you couldn't put it that way. You just have the... It's like saying someone that has a computer with, like, hacking tools on it is a hacker. You only ha like... That, that's like playing the cart before the horse. It's like, if I have a gun, it's not. it doesn't make me a murderer, <laughs> even if I could use it to murder. Want any part of this? I'm gonna delete this program. Uh, and I don't mean anything put up political by saying that gun one. I'm just giving a, an example. 
I could also say, you give me a chef hat, it doesn't make me a chef, it just means I now can dress like a chef. And what is what, I'm just looking at the side of her, like, dress, like, is it just the front fabric and then there's, like, the strings to connect to, like, a back skirt? Like, what the hell? Yeah, like, what is with, the, what is with these clothes? They'll be the program's protected, who knows what'll happen if you force to delete it. What do you mean? If you force delete something, you could delete your soul. Ooh, who is that? So that was Mr. Navik. Could be that ghost that everyone's talking about. <laughs> Don't let him get away. We gotta, we gotta go get him. Alright, hold up. Why are we chasing him? Right here. I'm going home. Nope. There is a firewall. I like how my character doesn't even look surprised. It's like, oh, my hands are behind my back, and I got this dope-ass glove. Uh, wasn't here before, what was it doing? Did some hackers do this too? So let's keep going onward, now let's go back home. But you can fly here, can't you? But you need to get on that pad. Uh, <gasps> exclamation points! Uh, could be in trouble, let's go after him, we find, find an exit there. Arad is kind of, he's neutral to me right now, but... No, not going. I won't. I mean, you will. Because you're a scared little girl. <laughs> Probably. Eventually. Okay, press triangle on the field you can save at almost any time. Uh, it's not possible to save in some locations. Okay. So, save in this game is, <laughs> is one of the better versions of saving. Um, because it just lets me do it anyway. So I'm happy because oh, I love I love that art. Oh, I love it. It looks so good. And there's cross save. Oh, okay. So okay. So usually when I think of cross save, I think of PSV to cross save, but it's just if you uh, if you upload something using PS Plus. Okay. Yeah. Uh, it's the Calum area stretch all the way back through here. Just to the from the cyberspace areas on the upper part of the Eden network. There's no trace of Verona, and you've gone further inside. Ugh, anime sigh. I should be careful. I mean, what can you do to defend yourself here? Like, apparently you feel pain in cyberspace, which honestly makes me think that you could die in cyberspace. Which seems like a very big design flaw. Because, like, that's one of the... Ooh, shock. What? Because that's always one of the reasons I have to think, like... Uh, like, a zombie apocalypse would not be as bad as fiction makes it out to be. Because it seems like almost every version of fiction... Ooh, that's... Oh, what the hell are you? You look like you're an ice elemental. Um... Every version of fiction that deals with, like, zombie apocalypse just makes it seem like no one has ever thought about a zombie apocalypse. Like, there's no comic books, no nothing. Whereas, in our reality, ooh, what the heck has been inscribed? Got some Bluetooth symbols. Um, uh, whereas, like, in our reality, we have fiction about, like, every kind of apocalypse, which makes me think... Like, we would be able, or at least a lot of us, uh, would be able to survive any of those given apocalypses just because we know what not to do based on the mistakes of the fiction. Of course, reality and fiction, separate monsters. But, oh, look at this Backstreet Boy. He even has, like, his own theme music. Although he seems about as tall or short. Of Okay, so chances are everyone was talking about him as a ghost, but it seems like he's a real boy. Like Panaki. He's a ghost that looked like me. That's true. Those might have been me. Some call me the Wraith of Eden. They say I'm not of this world. Do the simply I'm rather elusive and tend to turn up unexpectedly, that's all. Please relax, I'm not a ghost. I'm very real here in Eden. I used to get those who are lost. Like, I feel like that's not a very real thing to do. 
I feel like that's a very programmed style. Just a programming style that makes would mark you as a hacker. Still merely I'm not I haven't even hacked anything. I just have a program. There are hacks a wide variety of different goals here. Show for some to find our security holes. Thieves who steal accounts to rob money and data, others who are just out to prove their skills. Really a wide variety. What kind of hacker do you want to be? Chaotic evil. You're indeed a fledgling, if that's your only response. Not even hash from you again. I didn't give a response, I just looked at you unsure. Free to become a hacker if you want, or something else altogether. It's up to you. I'll let you do this neither here nor there. You came here because you're interested in hacking. No. And now because of that well actually I guess because that was the entire reason why we went, went to meet up with uh what's his face. Although I feel like we are more interested in just Digimon in general. Am I giving them power to the ba ba Digimon a try? Uh, I can only read so much before it just starts. I do like how I have a giant target symbol on my shirt. Remember me, birth of a hacker to be? First Digimon. They're behind you, guys. Digimon program. <gasps> Ooh, what? Okay. There are three different types of Digimon here, but you can only take one. Which will you choose? The excessively adorable animal type? Possibly fragrant plant type and mechanical looking machine type. So, the thing I have against this is like, okay, so this one, the excessive adorable one, uh, which is on the left behind my character, which is kind of unfortunate because I can't see them, so really expect you to watch the uh, thing, is this one is one of the main ones from the third series, where it's like a card game and they come to the real world. Uh, this one is one of the OG ones, and this one's just like a nothing one. So basically, they gave me, they gave me like, like a, like a Torchic, like a Bulbasaur, and then like, I don't know, a Geodude? Like I know that there is a mechanical, like, gear Pokemon, but I'm gonna take the excessively adorable one, because I like, I like Terriermon. Type, vaccine, or should we win? Terriermon? I want Terriermon. So made up your mind. Uh, because I don't mind the plant one, but I'm definitely not picking the mechanical one. It's been at the shell, several steps required to obtain a Digimon. If you discover and carry a Digimon program, run a scan and acquire the analyzed data. So I'll done with Digimon capture, you can use that without any restrictions. Just because you've got the analyzed data doesn't mean the Digimon program itself is yours. Which you must convert it. You must launch the Digimon program, implement it, and inspire it to that. First and foremost. Only link can serve as a digital monster or hacking program that is not to be trifled. Unlike Scan, however, Convert is not part of the Digimon Capture application. We hackers finally devised the technique needed, but certain rules were put in place regarding how it's used, in order to control how this power is exercised. Okay. Just the Digimon program is still weak, but it will grow in power and Digivolve. Uh, Digivolve into your champion. As you gain experience as a hacker, your programs become more powerful as well. Someday, immense power might be yours. Immense. When that day comes, responsibility will come along with it. Hackers may be free spirits, but they must never succumb to chaos. Never that. I feel like you could just become a chaotic hacker and have fun. I'm sure they're, I'm sure most of this went over your head, but tuck it away in a corner of your mind. Besides, merely having Digimon Capture gives you hacker status. It is a special program, but hacker's abilities, values, and goals can all be seen in how well the hacker can use Digimon programs. It's protecting the Order of Eden is a hacker's first duty. Really? That, that's a hacker's first duty. I would feel like if you're a hacker, you're meant to cause chaos in Eden. I'd be very happy if you tried to become that kind of hacker. I might do that for you, but after all, hackers have been with Eden since its inception. What? That makes no sense. You want the Digimon right now? Yeah, give me the Digimon. Here you want. Uh, you heard what I had to say in the site. You want to become a proud hacker too. Excellent. No, I don't want to become a hacker, I just want the cool monster. Start with a scan, have Digimon capture running, and target her. Huh? <laughs> what? Nani the fuck? So that thing looks like one of the monsters from the movie, like one of the first movies. Now I'm gonna sneeze in a moment. Oh, am I gonna sneeze? Can I put it back? Uh, 
to try out quick and you went right away. Everything but a big moment, which is fine, but wait just a moment. But to surprise me, I'll pay it to you. Most times, that would be a mistake. This is a bad joke by a little of a hacker as an attack on me by someone. Is that you want to laugh? You want to have a day one like that? Or you can never really forget about it. Well, what do you mean? Okay. Oh, no, you're concerned about the Digimon being chased. You're curious about it. Still, that's all the more reason to do it. The village got hurt interfering with the fight between two mere programs. They have feelings. Uh, they looked at me with love. I have to go help. I'm a good person. That's what you want, and you should do it. Chase after it. That's your decision. So it is interesting, because when your character's alone, they'll speak to you and uh, themselves, but um, they won't have that same type of talking when uh, dealing with other characters. Like they, it's only the uh, tree. I'm just going to say it again. Uh, yeah, I'm going to try... Oh, wow, that, I guess the, ver the first save just takes a little bit longer. So... Uh, this is what I'm talking about when something happens. So I'm guessing I'm going to fight uh, in a little bit. In a moment. Oh, look at my sassy hips. Boy, you really are. Do you intend to face off with a potential monster unarmed? Yeah, I'm going to punch it right in the eye um, with my super glove. Uh, you really are curious. No, just a soft touch. That's it. Okay. Don't touch me. I'm not soft. Except for my donkey donks. The working answers are both those things as well. Just this one's not gonna aid you. You don't need to do anything for the moment. Just learn. So like real hack use their skills. Okay. Oh, look at you showing off with your Metal Greymon. I think that's Metal Greymon. I think that was. Well, it seems it wants to fight with you because, you know, it's my Pokemon essentially. Some of the. Something of no deal, but that Digimon is now yours. Check it well and master the program. Okay. What's up? Ah, oh, it waved. Oh, that's so nice. Okay. 15%. I don't know what that is. So, stats and timeline, enemy stats, timeline. Yeah, you get that. Uh, yeah, I know. Uh, it's a blue, and it's red, gets to green. Command uh, start. You can post action position. Okay. Commands to your allies, X for other commands, hold down the directional button or the left stick while pressing X. Escape by holding down the R1 and pressing X. So escape. Okay, okay, that's good. And it just tells you. There's options, Act on your own, block commands, and you can auto battle. Okay. So that's not bad. Uh I'll probably be using the... I'm trying to decide if I want to use the D-pad or not. Uh, yeah, magic attack. But this is all technology, what are you talking about? Okay, I'll do it. There you turn it, and it's all foes. Okay, 37. Thunderfall 3. Wow. And I guess I'll just base attack. Okay. Seems pretty solid. Yeah, seems rather easy. Oh, and I leveled. Okay. End result. It has the level there. Picture. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. It does seem odd that it gives me yen. Uh, heal. Okay. And I can change the equipment and whatnot. Okay, okay. And then there's a special move that I probably can't get rid of. Store a little bit of HP for one, but I don't know. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Everything seems to be turning up Millhouse. Okay. Now oh, look at me and my smile. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, so sweet. Very ready to obtain, obtain Digimon without scanning it through Digimon Capture. Oh my god, it's like I'm Ash. Or more like Brock. Or James. Oh, it's more for a program to like a person. Ooh, because, you know, they have feelings. Mm -hmm. But this audio would probably be an irregular element of the hackers, because you can't be normal because you're the main character. Anyway, you're free, to, uh, you're free from your shell now. That's not you, I shall take my leave. Exclamation point. Speaking of I don't know what I'm saying. The young man with the nasty look in his eyes. Ah, the other irregular one. Him? He was headed to that area over there. 
the firewall won. Oh, old Eden entrance area, the remains of Eden's creation, just forgot your eggs, proof that lies, and the fact that an that original log of zone remains there untouched. This lock protecting can't be used, but the hack can probably deal with said lock. I'm guessing it's I need to have one Digimon to get through it. I need it. I'm in this space, I'm going to use that one. Boy, able to unlock it. His status on his skill set would be out. So he knows that Arata was, I guess, a hacker, maybe? I don't know. Are you surprised? Don't tell me he hadn't told you. Huh. Hmm. Okay, adding some backstory. In this case, as long as there's a cell right here, rather than him. That's right, I've introduced myself. ボクが言うわ。言うけど。チームが来るよ。チームが来るよ。チームが来るよ。チームが来るよ。チームが来るよ。チームが来るよ。チームが来るよ。チームが来るよ。チームが来るよ。チームが来るよ。チームが来るよ